it is Tuesday and I just got a new shipment in so I just thought I would share it with you as I unbox it so you can see what new books I'll have at the market on Sunday and if you like anything and you see that you really want it and you want to do a party and get it for free um, just let me know comment below on the on the uh, video and we can do a party together get you some free books for your kiddos all right so at the market, our sound books are always a huge hit. And so I got some extra ones. So I started, I got my ever popular Noisy Zoo. It comes with a little tab here so that, uh, just remove that. And then it's got all the sounds. This is such a popular one at the, at the market. If you don't have this one in your home, I highly recommend it. It's got all of these animals. Super popular, noisy zoo. I'll have another one of those. And then we also have the sound, this series, Jungle Sounds and Zoo Sounds. These are gonna be for slightly older kids because now there's an on off switch on the back. And in these books, you have to hunt and find the little silver disc. And this one. This one's gonna be jungle sounds. It's got lots of all oh, pretty colorful images. Oh, I, I like this one. Very cool. So that one is jungle sounds, and I have zoo sounds as well. It's gonna be the same, but uh, now it's a little bit different. All the different animal sounds. We love these books here. We have every single one and the kids just can't get enough of them. And then also more sound books, but these ones are the touchy feely kind too. So this is going to be our newest one in the series. Don't tickle the tiger. We, there's also don't tickle the hippo. Uh, don't tickle the lion. Um, there's quite a few in this series. We have them all here and the kids love them. And so these ones are great because again, there's the on off switch on the back and then there's the touchy feely part here. And so it's a combination touchy-feely and sound. So these ones are a huge hit. And of course, all of our sound books are the same price. They're all 20 bucks. And they're, they're really great books. Don't tickle the tiger, don't tickle the hippo. And then if you wanna shop on my website, there are more. There's also don't tickle the bear, lion, uh, dinosaur to search for don't tickle all right so then I also have some new chapter books too so I have now the Kenzie and Max series these are gonna be for our older kids Kenzie and Max is a nice mystery uh, action adventure Kenzie and Max are searching for their lost parents who have gone missing in London and you can see this is going to be the style. There's not too many images, but it's fun. It's adventurous. Hi, Nicole. And there's four in the series, and these are a great read, even for um, older kids and adults, too. It's a great series. Uh, Kenzie and Max, there's four of them. And, oh, here's a brand new series also boy band of the apocalypse so there's a boy band that is going to bring about the apocalypse and sam it needs to infiltrate them to uh stop them and so it's great it's funny it's humorous it's great if you're a boy band lover yourself and uh, there's a lot of making fun of boy bands in this and this one's going to be great also for reluctant readers because it's got some pictures and text and you can see that's the reading style because so boy band of the apocalypse there's two in that series um so i'll have those on sunday as well and then also another brand new one that we got this gonna be for younger this is our sticker dolly series so this is gonna be super girly there's six in the series and 
What's cool about these is at the front, it introduces the dollies and it's like a combination of our sticker books and our chapter books. So there's some stickers to dress the dollies and then you dress them on these pages and then it's a chapter book. And so here they go in their story. And so these are gonna have stories thinking about, you know, like fairy ponies, uh, secret mermaid, that kind of level and that kind of age. Um, so it's going to be our younger readers, lots of pictures, lots of illustrations, and of course the stickers in the book. And so there are six in this series. It's got the unicorn rescue, the castle in the clouds, the baby dragon, here's the mermaid trouble. Here, let me show you the, and in that one, the mermaids, you dress the mermaids. And see, it's all the mermaids. And there's the ice palace, so if you're fans of Frozen. And then, of course, the fairy picnic. And it's pink, of course. Um, so that's a great new series that we have, the Stigger Dolly. So I'll have that with me. That's a great one. And then also two other series that I've had for a while now, but um, they're super popular. It's Vlad the World's Worst Vampire and Hotel Flamingo. I have the books the first books of the series again. So if you want to start these, uh, Hotel Flamingo is about Anna. She's setting up a hotel and all of her guests are animals. So it's really cute, really innocent. And then Vlad the world's for worst vampire is also more innocent. It's, it, he's a, a vampire that's afraid of the dark. So you can imagine. Um, and so you can see like the inside of these, these are gonna be uh, for our nice middle, mid-range readers. Hotel Flamingo is going to be a little bit younger. You can see it's got all of the illustrations. Those are two great ones. Um, I've had a couple people buy these already and they like them a lot. So um, I have more book ones if you want to get started on that series. All right, now um, I also have some new sticker books. So I have loading up on sticker books. So I have tons of them. Um, so I have now these sparkly fairies. You can see how they sparkle in the light. So each one they're gonna have their little stickers. And what I like is that these ones tell you what pages they go on. So there's the scenes and you add the little stickers and you can see how they sparkle. Yay. Sparkly fairies. And then I also have just the little sparkly book. This one's gonna have everything from unicorns and mermaids to just everything. Fairies, snowflakes, very colorful. That one's another sparkly one, you can kind of see it. And then one of our newer titles, The Rainbow Fairies. My Hannah Banana loves rainbows. She draws rainbows everywhere. She wore her little rainbow jacket to school today. And so you can see all of these rainbow fairies, all of these rainbows. So this is another great one. Look at that page. All of these rainbows, so there's rainbow fairies. And then of course I got another unicorn title. These are gonna have some rainbows in there, but lots of little unicorns. Look at all those little unicorns. Unicorns and rainbows. What could be better? It's got little stickers, unicorns. And let's see, oh, I've got a couple of princess ones. I got princess dressing and another sparkly princess. You can see the sparkles. It's gonna have all of the, the little, you can dress them up. And then this one's a more of a dressing one where you can see there's the princesses that aren't wearing much of anything, just their undergarments. And then you have the clothes. And you have all of their clothes to put on. Now that's the sticker dolly dressing series. The dressing series is the one that's gonna have the stickers, the clothing. And then of course, just some dinosaurs. I got some dinosaurs, who loves dinosaurs? Lots of, lots of dinosaur stickers. There's dinosaurs, zoo. These ones are always super popular at the market. So I'm loading up on them, nice little zoo scenes and aquarium another popular series got lots of fish 
and sea creatures, and octopus, jellyfish, seahorses, sharks, penguins, aquarium. Those and so these are the little sticker series. You can see the size. It's going to be a little bit smaller, and then I'll also have a couple of the bigger ones. You can see the size difference. The bigger ones are going to be for the bigger kids. And usually these are going to be our girls. Our older girls. So I have the sticker dolly dressing fairies and ballerinas. And now these ones you can see they're just larger. And so they have the bigger stickers. And you can have all of these options to dress the girls. So many different clothing outfits you can make. Check those out. That one's ballerinas. And then fairies. Fairies is gorgeous. Got all the little fairies. All of the fairies and then all of their clothes, all of their outfits that you can choose. Look at that, all of those stickers. So that's gonna be the sticker dolly dressing series. Got the fairies, fairies and ballerinas. And then the, oh, I got another of our magic painting duos. This is going to be uh, dragons and magical creatures. Again, this is the paint with water. This one's a two fur, so we got both books for 20 bucks. Um, it includes the little um, paint brushes, all you need, and these are great. My Hannah Banana loves doing our uh, unicorn one, and so these ones are great. These are dragons and magical creatures, two pack. So that's another fun one to do. And then, oh, here's the last activity series. We have the new uh, stained glass series. This has been really super popular at my market, and so there's all sorts of different ones. And so here's like princesses. So these are cool. These, so you have like the see-through pages and it tells you what markers work the best. And so here's the, here's one sheet. You can color it and then you can hang it up on the window and it shines through. It's like a stained glass painting. And so this one's princesses. So there's also, it's kind of hard to see on camera because the pages are see-through but you can kind of tell, right? That was the frog, here's a prince, but it's cool because they all rip out and uh, you can kind of tell, oops, I got two pages. So you can see that there's the prince and so on. And so there's princesses, there's unicorns, dinosaurs, mermaids, monsters, and animals. So if you wanna see the inside of any of these, just let me know. Um, and here's animals. Again, kinda of hard to tell because the pages are see-through. There's a monkey. There's a giraffe. There's a giraffe, how cute is that? Can you tell what this is? Can you tell what this is? They're foxes. They're all snoozing foxes. So super cute. Oh, and I have one more of our look and find puzzles. So these are brand new. These are little look and find books. So each page is gonna be a different puzzle. It's gonna ask you if you can find different things. So who's holding a fishing net? And then at the bottom, there's other little things to find too. So each page is gonna be a little bit different. I have this in dinosaurs and um, woodland, woodland forest creatures. All right. I have just a few more in here. Oh, I have my Are You There Little Unicorn. This is a great little title for our little ones. It says, um, Are You There Little Unicorn? I can see your nose behind the trees. I can see you. Oh, it's not you. It's Hopping Hair with big long ears. And so each page is like, oh, I think I see you. Oh, but it's not. And then at the very end, oh, there's a rainbow, of course. And then there's the unicorn. Super cute. So it's got the little peek through windows. Oh, and then we have the firefighter. This is a great one because you, you can- rainbow? I did say rainbows. See, my Hannah loves rainbows. She's already here. Um, so this one's great. So this has a little sleeve that comes out. Yeah, it's brand new, so it's stuck. So this has a little card that comes out and you write your child's name and then you put it back in and see so there's space for three different names. And so then 
just slide it right back in. And now your child's name is here and they're part of the story. So let's say Nicholas, the firefighter, drives a red fire engine. Or we have Hannah, the firefighter, wears a yellow helmet. So it's a really cute ah. book about firefighters and you can put your child's name in it, you can put up to three, or you can even put like a dry erase. You can put like a piece of tape over it and put like a dry erase marker and put as many kids' names as you want. That's the firefighter. There's also a, a girl one uh, called the ballerina. Oh, hello, Hannah. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. All right, oh, Hannah has our flashlight. You know what that means? It's shine -a light time. <laughs> So I got three new ones in our Shine a Light series. Uh, these are super popular at my booth, specifically these three titles. Oh, Nicholas is excited now. These three titles I have, Secrets of the Seashore, Dinosaurs, and The Human Body. And all three of these, I cannot have enough. Okay guys, shh. And so if you've never seen the inside of one, they're pretty cool. Let me hold them. So, last night. Wait, 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 guys, guys, guys. Okay, okay. I have it fast. Okay, so here we have, there's a pregnant mom waiting. Waiting, can you see her? And then we have our flashlight. And then you can see the baby. Oh. Or like in this one, can you see, you see the kids? Can, can you see what's underneath their skin? Ready? And it's their skeletons. Check that out, Hannah. How cool is that? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, so these are brand new ones. So we have our own copies. So that I have the human body, dinosaurs, and secrets of the seashore. These no, are three that are our oh. most popular that Can I just can't have enough of. So I have more of those on Sunday. And then I also have our Lift the Flap ABC. This is great for our three-year-olds. And what it is is it's flaps. Every page has the flaps for all of the different letters. A, B, C, D, O. And it's a great way to learn all of the sounds, learn the alphabet letter placements, and so on. My kids love this book. We actually have this whole series. It comes in uh, numbers, opposites, first math. Um, there's a whole bunch at the very end. There's the full alphabet. And so it's, it's the uh, Lift the Flap series. So we have uh, colors, shapes, um, opposites, first math. Yeah, everything that I just said before. Uh, and then only a few books left. I have my very first body book. The body books tend to be pretty popular at my market, so I got a new one. And this one's got the nice thick hard pages. So it's like really thick cardstock. So it's easier for the kiddos to turn. It kind of teaches them like a, it's like a step in between board books and real pages. And this one is just all about body parts and everything about the body. And I think there's a page on the five senses and everything. So it's a really great, my first body book. And there's a series of these. I don't have them all at my market, but I have, there's science, dinosaurs, the oceans, the woods. Um, there's a whole bunch in this series if you want to get them online. My, fir my very first, you can uh, type that into the search bar and you can see all of the different ones in this series. And then now for some of our little ones, I have the very first bus book with the wheels. The lion is driving around to pick up all of the animals to take them to the fair. And of course the book doubles as a little bus and it can just travel around on the wheels. So that's a super fun one. And then also, oh, this one is super nice. I can count, my kids love this one. It's so what it is, it's this little set and it comes with nine little books. Each book, ah, trying to be gentle, trying to be gentle. Okay, so each one of these is gonna be a little tiny book. It's the size of like a block. Um, so each page has the number one at the very end. It goes one and one more is two. And you get to the two book. And then what's cool is that you can take the blocks out and you can stack them. You can stack them all up. There's all nine. You can make little buildings with them. And then at the very end, see there's the one and the two. It's like a memory game. And so you can do the 
well not memory matching and so then you can match the little blocks into their little spots and so my kids have loved this little set that we have uh, they do exactly this they take them out they match them helps with their number sequencing they read them they stack them up on top of each other they dump them out they put them back in they love this that we've had it for ever since they are about one or two years old and they just love this set i can count also comes in animals first words there's four different ones in this series but we like i can count the most just because and then I only have a few items left and there are puzzles. So this is gonna be the jungle puzzle. Uh, this is gonna have three puzzles in one. It's nine piece puzzles, so they're for our little ones. You like that one, Nick? You don't actually don't have this because you were too old for it. It's too easy for you. And it's actually the same. I don't know if you remember. Please don't climb by my stacks, guys. It's the same as our Jungle Sounds book. So there's the jungle, there's also the zoo. So if you wanted, you could get the sound book and the puzzle and it all go together. There is a soft cover version of the Jungle Sounds in here. Not quite the same. Um, be careful, Hannah, please go around. Please don't step here. And so this is our, uh, for our youngest, the youngest version of our puzzles. And then I also got a few of our other puzzles. So we got, of course, unicorns. Super popular. This is going to be a 100 piece puzzle. Comes with a sticker book. And so that's the size of the pieces on the back. So for puzzles, I have the unicorns. I've got zoo. This comes with a puzzle book in the back. And then um, bugs. These, all three of these are gonna be our 100 pieces. And then I have one that's our 200 piece puzzle and that's the solar system. And you can tell these pieces are a little bit smaller. It's gonna have a fold out solar system book on the inside. And just to give you an idea of the size difference, you can, I think you can see, yeah. Ah, the difference of sizes of the puzzle pieces. All of them are, the puzzles are all $15.99 for the big ones, and then the, the small little ones are $12.99. So it's a good deal, because they come with the book inside. All right, so that's it for my unboxing. Thank you for watching. Um, if you're gonna come by the market on Sunday, I look forward to seeing you as always. Um, come say hi, get some stickers, some baubles, um, and uh, pick out some new books for your little ones. Um, and if you liked the books that you saw and you want some free, let's do a party. Nicole, let's do a party together. And um, if you have any questions, let me know. Um, and until next time, I will see you around. All right, thanks everyone.